Dr. Tomi Mitchell knows working in the medical field carries a risk. And this week, she heard of a COVID-19 exposure at her clinic, the Pasqua South Medical Clinic in Regina. And she took to Facebook to share the news with her patients, but also to call for stricter measures to control the spread of coronavirus. And she joins me now. Thanks for being here, Dr. Mitchell. Hi, thanks for inviting me. So what went through your mind when you found out there was an exposure at your clinic? I was like, oh my goodness. I looked at my two kids and I'm thinking, God forbid I brought something home. So why did you decide to share this news through Facebook? Because that's the easiest, fastest way to share news, it seems, in our clinic. We have a, a strong following. And also it was going to be public knowledge in the next 24 hours as when the public health called me, they told me there'll be a public service announcement anyway. So I felt it was better being on top of things and letting patients know directly from the horse's mouth and also what we had done to reduce risks to patients. How urgent would you say it is the need for action? We are in dire straits. The numbers in this province and across the country are escalating at a very concerning number. I just heard a few hours ago that come, I think next week on Monday or Tuesday, Winnipeg is actually shutting down restaurants to take out only. They're closing all non-essential services. They're reducing number of people in retail stores. So they are shutting down. It's only a matter of time before we may be forced to do that or forced to go through the consequences of not making aggressive changes now. As we head into winter, what's your biggest concern about the coronavirus? Well, the coronavirus loves to spread where people are, and as things get colder, we're indoors. So I expect to see the numbers escalate as we approach major holidays, like people will be celebrating Halloween in different ways, so they'll be gathered together. Two weeks ago, we celebrate Thanksgiving, and we noticed the uptake, and we haven't even had cold weather yet where people are really stuck indoors. So my urge to Canadians is please do your part. This is our, this is a huge crisis that the modern day age has to deal with. And we're not asking for a lot. It is wear a mask. The way I now compare it, this is like a war in COVID. We need to win. So we need to pull out all the stops. We are not asking for our loved ones to go to war and be drafted. We are asking you to wear a mask. We're not asking you to give up something personal. We're asking you to wear a mask. It needs to be mandated. These rules need to come from top down. We are in trouble. I am really, really, really concerned. The numbers are startling and it's only just begun. God forbid any more Canadians lose their life because of this or any more people lose their businesses, their jobs. Like the the toll of COVID is astronomical and it will take years and decades probably for us to know the true impact of this disease. So let's do everything we have available to us. Wash your hands, socially distance, and mandate masks. Dr. Mitchell, thanks so much for your time tonight. You're very welcome. Dr. Tommy Mitchell is a doctor at the Pasqua South Medical Center in Regina.